sailing by I found my meaning in this life Clear white is flying in my eyes Underneath the blue, blue skies The waves come rolling called Love You More by the band Raccoon. This probably needs a little bit of an introduction because it is a band from the Netherlands, which is my home country. In my opinion, the best band we have over here, they sing in English, so that's nice. And I really wanted to get to at least one of their songs, and this is probably uh, their biggest hit so far. They've been around for quite a long time already, 20 years. This one was from their album in 2005, I believe, and they are, they are fantastic. I would say check out their work. It's a four-piece band, as in a singer who uh, occasionally plays the harmonica as well. Then we have a fantastic acoustic guitar player who pretty much lays down the well, the, the foundation of their arrangements, their... well, their... <laughs> and they're a very solid bass player who also sings uh, harmonies often and then a drummer. In some ways I would compare them to you too, not as in the level or the, 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 the type of music, but just how they fit together as a four-piece band with just a couple of instruments, that's pretty much what I mean. And again, this acoustic guitar player, Dennis is his name, he is fantastic. <laughs> I would say a rhythm guitar player, mostly I guess, he just has great riffs and he really carries uh, the arrangements of the band there for their, well, their songs. And this one, Love You More, it's, it's a highly... It's a beautiful song, what can I say? Finger picking, obviously, and in some ways pretty easy, in some ways it is not. Actually, I've made it a tad easier, so to, well, maybe make it a little bit more accessible to uh, whoever. Because the song is actually in the key of G sharp, the absolute key, that is, or A flat, depending on how you uh, look at it, I guess. He plays it in the key of A with his strings tuned down a half step. I decided to go for the key of G and then cape with the guitar on the first fret, at least if you would match, want to match it with the original recording. I, I was obviously on the second to match it with my vocals. Bart, the singer the vo uh, who does the vocals, he sings pretty high, so males might even want to take it down and take off the capo or even tune the guitars down and still play it in the key of G, a whole step down from him, that is. As for the picking, in it starts out with this classic Travis style picking. With swing feel, that is. One and two and three and four. And instead of straight feel, one and two and three and four and one and two. It's not that. It's really like. And then there are lots of notes which uh, appear between the ends of the beats, which you would play with your fingers, which are being emphasized. There is some sort of a melody here, there, so, and that is, in my opinion, what makes the arrangement really nice. It's still simple, as in if you would be very... Uh, good at Travis stop picking, let's put it that way. Make no mistake, it's not simple because it's pretty fast and you gotta pay attention to all those little details. But if you are very capable of just finger picking uh, like this, then it won't be such a stretch. I will point out all those little details because I am playing in the key of G. There are a couple of notes, one in particular uh, that I've compromised 
on, with, on. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm from Netherlands. <laughs> English is my second uh, language for that matter. If you can identify that note, good on you. Anyway, if you can, then, well, that's good too, because in my opinion, it is not such a big deal. It didn't make me want to play it in the key of a after all. I think this one works really well, even though, well, and so on. Further on, there are a couple of more, which I will point out also in the lesson, which... Well, it's also preference. Okay. <laughs> now, so, the picking, we take, of course, a thorough look at that, as in break down everything uh, in the arrangement of written out tablature for it. The chords really aren't, shouldn't be a big deal there. It's pretty much an A minor to G for most uh, of the song, and then it's actually like an A7 sus4, to be exact. Sometimes it resolves to A minus 7, and for G, so there are little things happening, there's a pull off in there, and uh, well, stuff like that. There's a D minus 7, there's a C, and there's an F sus2 at one point, and I think we are already there. Yes, Love You More by Rukuk. It's making its, uh, well, first appearance here in uh, Target at Totally Guitars. <laughs> but, like I said, I do want, you, I want to encourage you to take a listen at their uh, records. They, as, especially if you're into acoustic guitar playing, they really have really... I, why aren't they famous in the rest of the world? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I hope uh, I have exposed them at least a little bit here now. If you want to learn how to play the song, like I said, it's a gorgeous, beautiful song, and very nice acoustic finger-picking guitar arrangement there, then uh, indeed check it out at TotallyGuitars.com.